James C. Mather, associated with the James Webb Space Telescope, is set to observe the earliest galaxies in the universe's formation, unveil stars emerging behind cosmic dust and gas clouds, and disclose fresh insights into celestial bodies like Europa and Titan, potentially harboring life. These unexpected revelations from the James Webb Telescope about peculiar galaxies leave scientists with no further recourse. This advanced telescope, designed to address age-old human inquiries, consistently surpasses expectations in its latest research findings. Established laws governing the universe are now giving way, paving the way for entirely novel definitions. Is humanity edging closer to unraveling the genuine origin of the universe? Could the Big Bang be a fallacy? Or did our universe emerge from a black hole? GSC-13, a galaxy as ancient as it is enigmatic, defies conventional cosmological models. Existing a mere 325 million years post-Big Bang, this galaxy provides a rare glimpse into a distant epoch of the universe, shedding light on an extensively unexplored period until now. Jade's GSC-13 stands out not just for its vast distance from Earth, but also for its significance in shaping our comprehension of cosmic history. This galaxy provides a direct window into the conditions of the universe at a juncture when it was purportedly in the early stages of forming its current structure. Contrary to previous scientific calculations, James Webb's observations reveal that galaxies like GSC-13 should not theoretically exist based on conventional explanations. GSC-13, with its excessive size, impeccably organized structure and abundance of ancient stars, challenges established notions and introduces entirely new inquiries that unsettle the foundations of astrophysics and cosmology. The light emanating from Jade's GSC-13 has traveled billions of years to reach us, presenting the galaxy as it existed in a bygone era, enabling us to peer into the past and approach the epoch of the Big Bang. The James Webb Telescope boasts a reach spanning approximately 13.5 billion years, surpassing the capabilities of the Hubble which, despite its ability to observe nearly as far, fell short in delivering usable data from that specific era. Each collected light wave, traversing billions of years across the expanse of space and time, imparts valuable insights about its originating source. The radiance emanating from the 15 enigmatic galaxies discloses that these captivating entities deviate significantly from our initial expectations, presenting distinctions in composition, structure, and the circumstances of their formation. Consequently, these galaxies defy prior assumptions regarding the processes of star and galaxy formation. The earliest phases of the universe not only mark the emergence of the first stars and galaxies, but also serve as the bedrock for contemporary physics. The revelation of Jade's GSC-13 not only scrutinizes some of our captivating theories regarding galaxy evolution, but also undermines the fundamental tenets of astrophysics. The identification of Jade's GSC-13 by the James Webb Space Telescope stands as a pivotal moment in astronomy, serving as a wake-up call to the scientific community. Renowned astronomer and Yale University professor Peter Van Duckham asserts, it's undeniable. Images suggest that numerous galaxies in the early universe rivaled the richness of stars found in the Milky Way. Van Duckham, distinguished for his pioneering research utilizing cutting-edge technologies, brings a depth of insight to the forefront. As an astronomer who delves into the core of the matter, Van Duckham swiftly responded to James Webb's remarkable observations. Unlike some scientists who cast doubt on the authenticity of the measurements, Van Duckham acknowledged their validity. He affirmed the reality that galaxies like Jade's GSC-13 were closer to the Big Bang than previously assumed, a hypothesis challenging the established cosmic history.
This divergence of views stirred controversy among his peers, as many were reluctant to embrace such a fundamental shift in our understanding of the universe. Van Damme sees the discoveries as an opportunity for science to recognize old mistakes and finally get closer to the truth. For the Yale researcher, the fact that galaxies the size of our Milky Way already existed 300 million years after the Big Bang is an exciting task that the universe now presents to scientists. We can look forward to seeing what new paths in physics these discoveries will show us. The new research will certainly lead us to a completely new understanding of the Big Bang and its consequences. Cosmic background radiation, a direct relic of the Big Bang, remains measurable in space today, contributing crucial data to our understanding of the universe. Traditional models of star formation propose a universe initially too hot to support solid matter formation. It took hundreds of thousands of years for particles to bond and molecules to emerge, eventually coalescing into dust and gas clouds, the building blocks of the first stars. Over billions of years, these stars formed groups, culminating in the emergence of highly developed galaxies. Contrary to previous beliefs, James Webb's observations challenge this timeline, revealing the existence of highly developed galaxies just a few hundred million years post-Big Bang. Initial calculations suggested the first stars were massive blue supergiants with short lifetimes, known as Population 3 stars. However, James Webb, so far, hasn't detected any traces of these stars. Instead, the images reveal intricate galaxies with stars spanning various ages. John Mather, as the senior project scientist, played a pivotal role in the James Webb Telescope's development, aiming to unveil the universe's first stars and galaxies, a goal that has now been achieved. The mission's success sets the stage for scientists to delve into the data. As theories undergo re-evaluation, new concepts emerge, offering surprising scientific insights. The absence of dark matter and the debunking of the Dark Ages concept challenge previous assumptions. Consider a scenario where stars shoot out of a black hole in a Big Bang, akin to fireworks from a rocket. While it might sound unconventional, scientists are now poised to draw such groundbreaking conclusions from the data at hand. The realm of possibilities has expanded, inviting us to reconsider our understanding of cosmic origins. In a recent study, researchers from the University of Chicago and Princeton University proposed an intriguing idea that a black hole might have played a crucial role in the birth of our universe. Both classical and quantum physics suggest that a quantum fluctuation occurred before the Big Bang, generating no measurable force or matter. Subsequently, an observer event disrupted this state of equilibrium at a single point, causing the quantum fluctuation to manifest as matter, a phenomenon well established in quantum physics. The moment of observation, they argue, directly preceded the Big Bang, the certainty of the Big Bang theory was limited to mathematical and physical sense. Now, with new technology, we can witness phenomena like the Big Bang and the previously elusive Dark Ages, ushering in an era of exciting possibilities. Subscribe to the channel for more upcoming video highlights.